Now for the final of the men's 50 meter freestyle is five. And this is going to be an emotional one. It is likely to be a Chinese podium lockout, but one man will have something to say about that. In Daniel Diaz, it is his final Paralympic Games swim. He is retiring after this. He is one of the all-time greats, a 27-time Paralympic Games medalist. And this is where he bids the Paralympic Games farewell, the grand Brazilian. Going in lane eight to representing Spain, Sebastián Rodríguez. He is 64 years old and still going strong. He made the final of the uh, men's 200 meter freestyle S5 as well. The man who hails from Vigo and a multiple Paralympic Games champion. Yaroslav Semenenko goes in lane one for Ukraine. He has finished fourth in every single event. He has swum at the Paralympic Games in Tokyo 2020 and indeed in four of his last eight. Francesco Bocciardo. His name might be familiar because of his silver medal in the relay and two golds in the 100 and 200 free. But the Italian goes in lane seven for Italy here in the uh, least favorite event. Mohamed Zulkafli of Malaysia, the Asian champion and world championship bronze medalist goes for the Tigers in lane two. Already a full collection of medals for the, the man from Hangzhou. Gold in the relay, two silvers and a bronze in the 50 meter backstroke. It's Wang Li Chao. For the last time, we will see Daniel Diaz in the pool. He bows out of his Paralympic career here, the Brazilian superstar. And the man who has 27 medals. 14 of those gold. Daniel Diaz goes in three for Brazil. A win would give him his fourth gold of these games. Chung Tao goes for China in five. While in lane four, fastest to qualify. And a man who really wants an individual gold at these games, the 21-year-old Yuan Wei Yi. Up against the the uh, enigmatic Zheng Tao. And while he helped People's Republic of China to the four by 50 meter freestyle relay, 20 points, he's yet to win an individual medal, but when he set the Paralympic record in the uh, preliminaries, it was to break the uh, Paralympic Games record that Zheng Tao had just set. Daniel Diaz, recently named a member of the Laureus World Sports Award. The most exclusive team in sport, they say. And a man who is set to uh, continue his work with the academy beyond this. To bow out, does he bow out on the podium? China are fancying another lockout with Daniel Diaz of Brazil. The years of glory at his fourth Paralympic Games at 33 in his final race at the Paralympic Games. Now watch out for Cheng Tao. It was Daniel Diaz who got off to a really good start. Cheng Tao too going in uh, lane five and he'll have a really fast start. Diaz is going to come back at the Chinese swimmers as uh, Simonenko of Ukraine goes well in lane one, putting himself in medal contention here as he swims for a uh, backstroke style in the in this freestyle event. The world record is going to be going here and it's going to be Chung Tao who absolutely robs to his fourth consecutive gold medal at these games and Daniel Diaz fails to medal in his final swim at the Paralympic Games. Closing on Wang, he was unable to catch him right at the wall. It's Chung Tao. A fourth gold in five events at these games after missing a medal when finishing fourth in the 100 freestyle final. And seeing him now to 10 Paralympic medals overall.
but 27 Paralympic medals for the man a couple of lanes down. And Daniel Diaz, we say goodbye. But Chen Tao says, hello world, I have got this again. Backstroke is his event. Twice he has won the 100 meter backstroke title. He won a backstroke gold, backstroke gold here. Yuan Wei Yi has a silver medal and Wang Li Chao a bronze as China do what they aim to do and that was to achieve another podium lockout. The final time that Daniel Diaz will be out of the pool. He bids farewell. Brazil loves him. The world loves him. He has been a grand Paralympic ambassador for the longest time. He finishes fourth in his final race but take nothing away from what he has achieved Born in Campinas, discovering the Paralympic Games through fellow Brazilian Cordualdo Silva, who competed at the Athens Paralympic Games and then smashing records throughout his career. He's ended it here, but this was a race that belonged to three Chinese swimmers. And I mean, Daniel Diaz, he went out as best he could, but he just could not keep up with this powerful kick right here of Zheng Tao. Zheng Tao was well ahead of world record for the majority of the way. He lost it right in the end. You see all of them slamming with their head to the touch pad. I mean, in order to take down Daniel Diaz here, Zheng Tao, he had to go a new Paralympic record. That's how fast this heat was. And the Chinese swimmers with their kicks, they're so dominant. They've really perfected the strategy here. So Zheng Tao is victorious. What a race, what a race from Zheng Tao. I am going to take it in Paralympic record time. Not quite on world record pace, but Zheng Tao ahead of Yuan Wei Yi and Wang Li Chao. As they lock out the podium for China ahead of Brazil's Daniel Diaz and Mohamed Zulkafli finishes a very respectable fifth. Sebastian Rodriguez, 35-51 for the 64-year-old, 16-time Paralympic Games medalist himself.